Important news this evening for anyone getting or giving a tattoo. According to the FDA, six inks used for tattoos are believed to be tainted with bacteria. KCAU 9 reporter Marina Bach explains what can be done to keep your tattoo experience safe. Marina? Yes, the owner of Living Art Tattoo Studio I spoke with today says that he's very familiar with the recent FDA recall. He says knowing things like that and making sure that it's not going to affect his customers is a big part of running his business. You know, again, everything is uh, inspected by health departments, um, and, and it's actually good that this was caught and came out when it did so that it didn't spread. That just goes to show the importance of having these regulations in place. Andy Bagshaw owns Living Art Tattoo Studio. He says making sure a new tattoo is properly cleaned is crucial to preventing a skin infection. Signs of infection, again, the redness, the swelling, the purulent drainage fever, contact your primary care provider or go to your closest urgent care. They can help treat that for you. In Iowa, tattoo artists are required to go through bloodborne pathogen and first aid training to ensure their safety and that of their customers. Um, you know, a big part of that is understanding cross contamination and how not to contaminate your work area. Um, obviously using new products on everybody or sterilized equipment. Ruth Ann Yule is a nurse practitioner who has not only dealt with tattoo related skin infections but has a tattoo of her own. He touched it up really well. I had no problems with it. I watched for signs of infection. I did use some Tylenol. It was a little um, uncomfortable for the first 48 hours but he did a great job. It's been 14 years and haven't had any issues with any of this stuff. Uh, and I think a big part of that is because of how closely we watch it, you know. Yule told me she sees three to four patients a year that are dealing with skin infections related to those new tattoos. She says following those safety precautions that should be given to you by your tattoo artist is going to help keep you healthy. Live in the newsroom, Marina Bach, KCAU 9 News. A lot of folks with tattoos these days, that's for sure, Marina. A lot of people paying close attention.